Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make a boss loot drop in Roblox Studio. But before we get started, make sure to subscribe to the channel. We're on the road to 2,000 subscribers. And at 2,000 subscribers, I'm going to be doing a Robux giveaway that you're not going to want to miss out on. All right, let's get into it. All right, the first thing you're going to want is a dummy or a NPC, something like that. And I just have mine right here. All right. And then we're going to go into the dummy and we're going to go into humanoid and we're going to add in a script. You can name this to whatever you like. And in this script, we're going to do function on died. And then we're going to do a wait for one second. Local chest is equal to game dot server storage chest colon clone. And then we're going to do chest dot parent equals game dot workspace and script dot parent dot parent colon destroy then we'll go outside the end and we'll do script dot parent dot died colon connect and on died all right and then we can make our chest you can make your own take one from the toolbox whatever you'd like i'm just gonna make a just a block real quick and i'll just do like a cylinder on top or something like that. Row builder does not compete with me. All right, and then I'm just going to group these two together and I'm just going to name it chest and we'll put it into server storage. All right, and we can test it out. All right, and then when we go to our dummy and we kill him, our chest appears. And that is how you make a boss loot drop in Roblox Studio. If you did like this video and it helped you, please don't forget to give it a like and subscribe and I will see you next time.